has left the Avatar. He was on a boat. Exploring the sea, the dead of night. Welcome back to the hardcore Minecraft Let's Play. Let us continue exploring. Hopefully we'll be able to find some really cool things. Alternatively, we might just immediately hit land, and land is not terrible, however. We're finding a few jungles, actually. Look at this. This is just one jungle straight into another jungle. Also, I think this is the uh, limit of where our map is going to go in terms of this way, so we're actually nearly done exploring by sea. There is a skeleton. We shall make a turn here. We've sort of got an idea of what's nearby. There is, There are jungles over here. If there's jungles here, that means that we could find a cat and then go and uh, slowly walk it back home. It'll be a long walk. However, it all depends on how much you want to have a cat. Cats to do scare away creepers. Creepers are afraid of cats in this. You do actually want the uh, cocoa uh, plants. It is a shame it's not daytime right now. I would be tempted to go and have a look for them. Go get some jungle sapling. You need four of them to actually grow a jungle tree. That is a fully armoured up... What, zombie? No, skeleton. Right, let's uh, let you be a fully armoured up. Oh, that one's armoured up in gold. There's a very small chance that when these uh, creatures die, they um, drop the item that they have, or one of the items, if it's armour. Sometimes that can be pretty good. Sometimes you don't want a spider to follow you into the water. That spider's following me. Fortunately, spiders are not very fast swimmers in this, so I should be alright. In theory. Look at all this... There's a lot of jungle, actually. There is a lot of jungle. Look at this. Just loads of it. Don't want to head too far inland, though. Don't want to get stranded here at the dead of night. Stranded by creepers and... Monsters. This is actually heading inland some, so we're going to turn around now. Yep. Wow, it's just like a convention of creepers. There's about five of them. Okay, you got to be careful to avoid hitting the squids. The squids will quite literally spell my doom. I'll spell it out. D-O-O -O dead. Doom. But we have nearly explored this uh, entire little area. Bit of map here that we haven't yet. Uh, I like to fill in every single dot, which with the large maps makes a huge problem because you end up taking ridiculous, sometimes very dangerous risks just to fill dots on a map. What we need to do is we need to go all the way down here and follow the land some more. A lot of nice, peaceful exploration. And this exploration is at night. The moon, however, is slowly starting to set. Which means that soon... We will have daytime once more. And then we might just head back. Might head back... Back home. See, we'll follow the land for now. There's a lot of mountains here. Not a bad thing. You'd want to build a uh, a home on top of a mountain. Nice view of the surrounding area. Very easily defensible. I mean, half the uh, defense you have is the fact that it's annoying to get to. Which is also a downside for bringing in resources, because you're on top of a mountain. And it's annoying to get to. But if you've built a castle on top of a mountain, you probably have the money that that won't be a problem. At least you hope that won't be a problem. And now it is daytime. We've spent all day and all night out at sea. I suppose it's... Oh! Uh, meddling squids! 
I suppose this technically does count as C. Does count as C. We are a fair bit away from... This is actually an island. This is actually an island. A very small island. There is a hole in that sand. That's curious. So curious I'd be tempted to look, but only tempted. Generally, they, uh, I remember they added in the uh, sandstone. Like, hey, you've spawned in a desert, here's how you make stone. Also it meant that they could make their uh, pyramid structures out of sandstone. Okay, we've got to clear out this area now. All this uh, unexplored bit of ocean over here. A fair bit of it, but I don't think it's going to really have much in it. Except that bit, it just has lots of mountain. It almost, I don't know, maybe that bit... Maybe it's not an island, but it almost... You could make it an island quite easily. You could quite easily make this an island. Wouldn't take much effort. There's a, certainly a bit of an outcrop of land here, that's for sure. There's an island up there. But it's nowhere near the distance that the uh, island in the first season was. I mean, that was miles away from anything. I'm not sure with the new way that they spawn seeds, the new way they spawn maps, that you would even get such a map anymore. If it, if it's actually possible for you to spawn in the middle of the ocean on an island, I I, I don't know anymore. It's it's something I am I am unfamiliar with. I haven't really tried. I I could try. I could try and see if it's possible. It probably is. This island has snow. There's massive mountains. Massive mountains. These mountains are huge. Absolutely colossal. Absolutely colossal. Okay, so now what we want to do is we want to turn round and... We can actually try and explore the inside of it, actually. Do you know what? Let's try and explore the inside of the island. We need to hit this a fair few times to, uh... First we need to, uh, push it very gently over here. Get it in our inventory. Let's do some exploring of the actual inside of this mountainous area. I want to get this fully mapped. I may have picked the wrong method of doing this. A.K.A. jumping all the time. This bit's tall. This is very tall. The Avatar today climbed a mountain! Because he wanted to fill in a map. There is a cave. We are not going in. Wow, this gets tall. The fact that it's getting all snowy up here means it's tall. <laughs> Hello! It's like we're on another world. Except we're not. We're just on a little mountain. There is a big little cave area. How can it be big and little? I don't know, it just is. It just is. Moving on! This would have been a cool place to start my, uh... My abode. Look at this! I can actually get down now, don't I? Yep. Fortunately, there's a nice, relaxing incline here that we shall use. Go! Most of the island is uh, there's a small cave. Pretty well explored. I'm not going to take any of the resources. I don't really need them just now. There is indeed that uh, underwater temple. It's just right there. It's right there. I'm really not a fan of the fact that it's right there, actually. That's really not good. Right, we're going to have to sail past it. A little. We just need to sail enough that we can get rid of these dots. We don't want to get zapped. 
We just want to get past it. If we get zapped, we are so going to perish. And there we go, that's a fair amount of map explored. Not the largest amount of map ever explored, but hey! It's map. Also, really don't know the inside of those places. Have no idea what those places are like on the inside. So we know that on the far edge of this map is a, um, a jungle, which means potentially we could get a cat that way. Wolves, which then should become dogs, not so sure, they tend to be a bit more random. There are a few types of biomes where they'll appear more, more um, frequently, but I haven't seen any of those nearby. Okay, let's head back home. Home is, I believe, quite literally over here. Quite literally over here. Let's try not to crash the boat, shall we? There we go. There appear to be little dungeons absolutely everywhere in this place, don't there? There we go. One of them. We could keep exploring. Couldn't we? But I'm not entirely sure I want to just... I want to check on all of my uh, crops. It's a good thing this is a waterproof uh, map. Let's eat this mushroom. I was about to say mushroom, but I actually meant apple. We'll be eating the mushrooms later. We'll be eating the mushrooms in the form of stew. We'll need to make some sort of place to grow them for that. And that's not as easy as you'd think, because it needs to be dark. And if it's dark, that means that it will attract monsters. And monsters are not good for trying to harvest and grow something. At all. Even a little. Ah, welcome back. So use my timepiece to collect resources. Excellent. Here we go. Resources have been collected. Already that. Here's a pumpkin. Hey Derek. How you doing? I've just been exploring on the sea! I found many wondrous things. I found treasures beyond your wildest imagination. I don't think Derek is interested in my treasures beyond wildest imagination. I'm not surprised. Derek is a busy pig, after all. We need to build somewhere where we can harvest these mushrooms at some point. Not just... I don't want to do that just yet, purely because I'm probably going to be terrible at it. There most certainly is an optimal way of doing it. I've not figured that out yet. I'll have to think about how I'm going to do it. Also, we can still hear zombies right next door, literally. There must be something that I've missed. I just haven't. I can hear them beneath me. Let's go find out what's going on here. They're this way. I distinctly hear them this way. So what if I were to go outside? And dig down? I'm curious about what on earth this is. Like it's somewhere around here. Where? It's it's somewhere around here. Okay. We're gonna find this. This means digging just down. I'm gonna find what this is. It sounds close. That could be misleading though. Hello? Just digging randomly into the ground in search of monsters. 
We don't want the map out right now, we want torches. They sound really close. I do not know where they are. Where are they? Okay, it actually sounds less clear over here. It's almost like they're just further down. You know what, they probably are just further down. All this way. What about this way? Need to figure out where they are. It's not the random groany sounds of zombies while I'm, uh... Trying to relax at home. Now it sounds more like it's coming this way. Hmm. I get the feeling I'm just traveling around in a massive circle. Also, it's getting dark. Let's not stay out here when it's getting dark. Last thing we want is to get killed by something like a creeper. Or a skeleton. Or something worse. There are worse things than both. Creeper skeletons! No, no, they're just skeletons. But an exploding skeleton. There's a thing. I have no idea where those are. It'll take me a while to find it. But we will find it. Let's rest. Let's hope some sort of zombie does not spawn in the middle of my house. Nope, zombie did not spawn in the middle of my house. That is handy. Let's go looking around, see if there's anything horrible that has spawned nearby. No, nothing. Excellent. More exploration time, I think. Some people have suggested if it might be the place that I, uh... Might be the place that I originally, uh... Went and, uh... Built my abode, so to speak. Oh, hello. See, you can hear... Them sort of over here? Let's go back down. Are they in here? Okay, I'm gonna explore in here. They're not in here. They can't be in here. That would be silly. That is silly. Why am I even exploring in here? They're not here. Here at all. I have no idea. When we come back, folks, I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. I'm gonna find out where all these monsters are coming from and deal with it. Once and for all! Probably by just putting lots of torches there, killing the ones that are there, and running away! I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. Darn monsters, keeping me up at night! Curse you!